This is not a video I want to make. You know, I don't really want to reflect on this because it's kind of sad for me. Um, if you guys haven't gotten the news, um, Inga Grandpa has passed away. You know, and it sucks, you know, because I mean, the only good thing I could say about it is that he lived his life pure and full, you know. He lived a long, long time. I can't say the same for my cousin that passed away in uh, 2014, three years ago, but... Still sad. I, I think he was taken way too early, you know. As soon as I got the news from uh, my friend from the UK, who originally broke me the news, because... I took a break from Angry Grandpa for a bit because, you know, I was watching other uh, YouTubers. But I do go back to him, you know, to check back every once in a while because the channel didn't really feel the same. And as soon as he broke that news to me, just all memories that I had of him, you know, when I had the Wii and I watched the the, the video on that TV over there, which used to have like a big bulky crappy one, and I watched it, and then, you know, I always wanted to keep the volume down because I was a little, I was like, um, preteen, and my parents would flip if I, they heard bad language in that, so, yeah, that memory flashed in my head, you know, and... It's really sad, you know, because my grandma is in the hospital, you know, and she's hooked up to all these tubes and everything, just like how angry grandpa was. And, you know, to be honest, I'm just preparing for the inevitable. Because I don't think it's going to be long before my grandparents are gone too. I just... It's still hard for me to comprehend this. You have no idea just how in denial I am. I bet Michael is, because that was his father, you know, and you know, and I'd done some research, you know. I watched Michael's vlog on his Kid Behind the Camera channel. I didn't really hear any direct confirmation that his dad passed away and then I looked back at the angry grandpa channel like an hour later and there it was title rest in peace angry grandpa you know and he included a um, video of angry grandpa at the end of the video with him hooked up the tubes and everything and he just, he just looked terrible, you know, like, it's almost like he had, like, tubes, like, running out of his nose and everything, and he, I mean, he looked like he was in terrible shape, you know. It sucks, you know, because I don't even know if this videos monetized or not because I'm uploading it from my phone you know well if it is monetized somehow next time I um upload a video from the computer I'm gonna go on my channel and make sure I demonetize this video because I'm not a scummy douche
um, make the money off of a dead person because that's very dishonorable, you know. And uh, I just want to say thank you, Angry Grandpa. for your inspiration and the quality content that you've been putting out there. Now I say about a bunch of other YouTubers, Luigi Kid, um, Master Max 888, PewDiePie, Markiplier, Riskrim, who else? Teenage Bratwurst, you know, all basically all the people I subscribe to you were all my inspiration and I remembered reacting to Angry Grandpa's fart compilation while I was recording my TV with my phone and I was like laughing at the screen you know that flashed in the back of my head too when I heard the news um uh, I'm still in shock you know it, it's late at night and I just decided you know what I need to make a video on this and I was about to make a video on net neutrality but I just thought to myself you know it just had to wait because this is more important very more important you know I remember watching Tina's video on Angry Rabbit's passing and she was just bawling. Yeah, that tough, you know, redneck type woman was bawling over his death. And that's saying something because we all knew her as, you know, the tough um, trailer park woman. It just, she just broke down, you know, and like I said, that's saying a lot, you know. He was always a life changer, you know, and he changes my life. You know, I was always down and depressed and everything, you know, because I had to deal with middle school, you know, in middle school, let me tell you, it was hell. You know, I've been badly bullied in middle school, high school, you know. I run into some jerks here and there, but other than that, it's like heaven. But middle school was hell, and I had so much trouble there. And I was badly bullied. Why? Because of my looks. Because I was weird, and I was ugly, and because I was a brony. I was badly bullied, and angry grandpa along with a bunch of other YouTubers, pulled me through it. There's only two things that kept me going. YouTube and video games. That was it. You know, and... I just want to say thank you for helping me through middle school. It sucks too because I I wanted you to be one of my first YouTubers that I shook hands with. I mean, I wanted to shake hands with Bruce Lee. And I realized he died a long time ago. Because Dad told me, you know, because he got me into Bruce Lee. And, you know, I was like, man, I wish I could meet him. He's like, yeah, he's dead. It's I just watched, you know, I, the beginning of Isaac's stream talking about angry grandpa, you know, and I'm just going to send prayers to Mike's family. You know,
I'm speechless. I, I can't make up words for this. Because... I could just... I don't know, I keep getting these flashbacks of me back at middle school having a rough day and I remember just plopping on my PS3 before the PS4 even came out and just binge watching YouTube. And what sucks is that I didn't even have a phone back then so I couldn't use this to look it up. I just had to use my PS3. I remember I had this RCA TV, just the big, ugly, bulky one, instead of my flat screen that you saw in my angry grandpa reaction, you know. And I always remember just laughing my butt off at him just destroying the kitchen and him demolishing, you know, all types of objects, you know. I remember that Angry Grandpa has cancer video, you know, and I was destroyed, you know, and what destroyed me even more after that was the whole Charlie Chill situation, you know, and I still can't believe all that happened. You know, and the only thing I have left to say is that when the time comes for me, when I finally die of old age, I hope to see you there in heaven. May you rest in peace, angry grandpa. You are greatly missed. Sly out of here.